So hello guys, welcome back to my channel Coding Phoenix and in today's video we are going to be installing the Visual Studio Code software. So it's basically a studio for coding, but, is it, uh, but it is used for more, um, you know, like complex coding. It is just like brackets. So we are going to be learning how to install it. So basically, to go, uh, I'm going to give you the link for this guys. So. Uh, I'm using Windows, so I'm going to download. Uh, you uh, click on the Windows. If you guys are using Mac or Ubuntu or Red Hat Fedora, you're gonna click on these buttons. So I'm using Windows, so I'm gonna click on this. So you're getting downloaded here, as you guys can see. So it's gonna take some uh, time, it depends on how fast is your internet. So that's how fast your download is going to be. So so, okay. so now it's downloaded, we're gonna open it. So you click on I accept, I accept the agreement. Then you get, uh, so this is your wish. So you can click OK. I'm clicking on next and then you have to click on install. So it's installing this. It's one second. So from now on we are going to be using this for complex coding. We will probably be using our um, brackets. So yeah, you need to click on finish. And there guys, so this is how it's going to be. So, uh, um, so basically I already have brack, I mean, oh, sorry, visual studio code. So, this which one like this. So then uh, basically you have to create a new folder, you have to click on a uh, new, I, I mean you have to create a new folder, you need to create an open folder, so yeah, that's how you do this. And you will get some option for, um, you know, like setting it, so yeah. And then you have to click on the search, can you guys see, so you have to click on the search, and you need to click on live. One second, guys. Yeah, click on the so so if you click on live server, it will show um a live server here. Then you to click on install. So I've already installed the live server, so that's why it's not showing you. So, yes, guys. That is how you do it. So from now on if you want to create a project you have to create a new folder, then you have to click here, file, then you have to click it uh, click on open uh, you know open folder. So yes guys, that's how you do it. From now on we will be using this guys. So yes, thank you for the video. Hope you enjoyed it.